Hey guys, uh, we're down in the Palm Nursery here, north end of Salt Spring Island, and I uh, just had an order uh, yesterday come in. Uh, they requested a flat of uh, Trachycarpus palm, so palm trees by the flat. Generally, we don't like to sell our liner size pots because these liner size pots get uh, upgraded to uh, one gallon size pots, and we grow them on, and then from there uh, go into twos, and some go into fives. So, um, the, the the people that are buying these, uh, I've sold them. Um, palms in the past, quite a few palms. They actually have a field grown uh, palm nursery on the very south end of Salt Spring Island. I guess they've been doing it down there for maybe 16 years, something like that. And uh, they have uh, rows of them irrigated. I, they probably have a few hundred of them uh, in a field there. And if you want a, uh, a dugout palm tree, you want a big palm tree, you can uh, contact those people and uh, they'll. you have to go dig it. Just like kind of like digging a live Christmas tree. And uh, so I, I'm assuming that they're going to put these guys in uh, more rows out in the garden. And, and here on, uh, in this climate, you can actually plant them as is, just like this. Providing you have good soil, they're actually going to grow pretty good. So uh, these are all locally grown uh, Trachycarpus fortunae uh, palms, Chinese windmill palms. I collect, I harvest the seed, I harvest the seed from really nice palm trees around the island. And these particular ones, uh, the parent plants have super stiff fronds. And a lot of these palm pots have two sometimes three palms per pot. So uh, anyway, they're getting a pretty good deal for this flat. But like I said, I don't really like to sell flats of palm trees just because we need these guys for um, stepping up into bigger pots for the nursery stock. So anyway, that's what a flat of Trachycarpus, uh, locally grown Trachycarpus palm uh, seedlings look like here on Salt Spring Island. And remember, these guys stay out year round in these non-heated cold frames. The only thing we do with these cold frames here is put Lexan sheets over top so there's no heat whatsoever in these uh, to keep these guys warm in the winter and uh, even through uh, you get a cold snap it's amazing that these little pots uh, don't freeze I guess it just doesn't get cold enough to do that so every second day I'm down here watering because it's just so freaking dry so some of them have a little bit of brown ends on them but we really can't help that just because we're on a well we have to really conserve water and with two B and B's going uh, even more iffy, right? So that's what the flats look like right there. Those are all flats in there. And then of course, you've seen the nursery before. There's uh, two gallons here, one gallons. And that's this year's stuff we potted up. And look at the size of these things now, growing in eucalyptus, uh, Douglas fir chips mixed with topsoil. And then these are two gallons. And then we got a lot of, uh, there's, those are fives up there. There's some twos on that side. We've got a bunch of twos up there, more ones there. Behind the pump house, there's uh, ones. And, uh, and then there's some twos over there in front of this uh, palm tree here. But these guys were potted this year and look at how fast they're growing. I fertilized them all with a slow release and they are really happy. And I think today I'm gonna to come down here and hit them again with some more uh, fertilizer. But the key is keeping these guys watered. Otherwise, uh, yeah, they can get pretty stressed in this dry uh, weather. And so those are twos in there as well. And uh, thank God we have some big trees around here to uh, give them some uh, partial shade. Otherwise, uh, in these heat waves we've been getting, these guys would have fried down here in the pots. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more palmy videos here, you palm lovers. Because I know you guys, when you're watching these videos, you guys like palm trees as much as I. There's palm, palm oil's running through our blood, right? Cheers to you, man. Happy palm growing. And remember, plant a palm, you can't grow wrong.